What's happening, in sports fans? We continue our playoff coverage by heading out to Point Loma High School to talk to the Lady Pointers, the soccer team. They were in action. They got that quarterfinal dub, one nothing. That had to feel good. Ladies, thank you very much for joining us. Congratulations. I'm assuming the semis got to feel pretty good. That has a nice ring to it. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about getting that quarterfinal win, one nothing at San Diego at home. That had to feel pretty nice. Yeah, it was really nice. We... We've expected to come this far because we've worked really hard, so we're just happy to keep going in the CIF. Well, you talk you, you talk about that hard work, and getting home games in the playoffs has to feel like kind of a, a payoff for all the season work that you put in, you know, grinding, 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 so you get to play these games in front of the home fans, get that home field advantage. Talk about how that feels to have that kind of payoff and, and being able to play these games at home. Yeah, at home we have lots of fans that come out, and it feels really good when you have support behind you when you have these big wins and big games. So we love having the home games. All right, so you guys get a one nothing win. You're into the semifinals. Does anything change right now in, in practice and the mentality? Where is your headspace at as a team? I think we're just more focused on anything, but we're not changing anything major because we've worked for this the whole season. So it's not anything drastic that changes. Okay, so a fair amount of teams that are, you know, at this point in the season still playing, they, they usually have either a good luck routine or a ritual or something they have done all season long to help them get here. Anything that you guys are, are willing to share with us, or is this all very top secret stuff that, that is, uh, is off limits to us? Um, one thing that we do is every home game before we go onto the field, we all have, a, we go in a circle and we do the Husker prayer, and it really hypes us up for the game, and it's a really good ritual. Okay, I'm going to hold you there for a second while the plane goes over. Uh, that is the peril of, of going to Point Loma is you have the audio there every now and then. But So you said the Husker prayer. Um, are we able to get a video of that uh, tweeted out or Instagrammed out the next time you guys get it done uh, before a game? Yes? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you very much for, for sharing that with us. We will have all the information on their game, when and where you can check it out. Uh, girls, thank you so much for joining us. Congratulations, and hopefully we'll be able to talk to you uh, before the championship game. Thank you. Thank you. You guys have a great day. You too.